Hello everyone and welcome back to another Mother video. Myself, Liam. Today I've taken a rest from making the bugs fight each other, which is what I've been doing for the past two hours. And as you can see in front of me, we have this little church, sort of shrine, weird house that is disconnected by a bridge here, which I'm pretty sure, and correct me if I'm wrong, because I could be completely wrong, but you cannot jump across it, you cannot get into it, and when I try to, if you can see here, pass this line... I get stuck here. I've also tried to teleport past it, and as you can see, I just keep hitting an invisible barrier. So I imagine you'll be able to get into it at some point, but for the moment, because it is very, very early days of this game, it is going to be closed off to the rest of the players, which makes me wonder why and what is inside. And with the power of mods and insert cam, I'm going to show you what is inside. So once you get over here, you know, nice little steps coming up. You can see basic entrance. I have no clue what bugs are going to be in here or when you will actually be able to get in here or what will be in here. So I'm coming at you with literally no knowledge whatsoever. No knowledge whatsoever. But I just want to just show you what's inside of it. There's a little coffin or something like that. Let's see what's inside of that. Nothing. Okay, good. I was expecting a dead body, but nothing. Uh, then you go over here. There's some stairs that you can go down. I'm going to have to apologize for the janky camera movement. It's not, it's not great. Uh, so there is sort of like a little... Little catacombs area underneath here. Not really catacombs, but where they keep like all the dead bodies and stuff like that. Oh, there are some dead bodies. Well, not dead bodies. There are some skeletons. Some very rigid skeletons there. Again, sort of rigid skeleton there. There's some skeletons on the floor. There is a big overgrowth coming out of the wall here. But yeah, so there's not actually there's not actually too much to go on down here. There's nothing really too interesting. I mean, there's no way they would create this whole space and put effort into into making this area if they weren't going to put anything into it. That's more or less it. You go out to that bit there. There's also a tower. You can't get up to the tower. There's no way up. But obviously, I can fly through to see what's in around here. It pretty much is just a rundown old church. That's more or less it. It's not that great. Uh, apologies in advance. I thought there was, this is going to be more in-depth than it actually was. There's not a lot there. But whether there'll be like a final boss there, I don't know, or something. But you get a nice view from up here of the rest of the map. Like, it is a fairly, fairly big map. Uh, but that is just, yeah, that's just a small look into what is actually inside. It looks cool. It looks cool. At the moment, like I said, early days, there's not going to be too much. There isn't too much in there, but they've obviously fleshed it out, so there will be eventually something in there. Whether you can actually get into it now, I haven't played the game that much. You might be able to get into it somehow if you progress through the story and the quests. But for the moment, it is sort of out of bounds. You cannot get up there. Not that you'd want to go in there because there is nothing in there. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this very, very short and fairly boring video. But if you do want to see any of our other content, which I have on this and Grounded, a similar game, I've done some weird little bug bug battle videos on this. Uh, just explored the garden, which is pretty fun with all the bosses and stuff like that. Uh, but thank you and good bye!